Hi guys, welcome once again. In the last video we have seen how to update your data with this update button. And in this video I will show you how to delete your data when you select or when you select or enter something into this employee ID text field and you want to delete that employee ID then how can you delete that data I will show you today so first of all we will go to our toolbox and take a button and I will go to my property fields and I will rename it as delete button and I will also edit the text as delete okay and now I will select this update button because I have shown you some code for the update button so just double click it this update button and if you don't know this code just watch the last video for how to edit or update your database and I will copy all this code from this string con string to this to the end of this catch block and I will use this code into my delete button in order to save time so just go to your delete button and double click it and we reach to its method or function and in between this delete button click event just paste your code which you have copied from update data so once again by this time you must know that this is for creating the connection with the database and this is username and password and in this field we write our query to connect with the database okay so we will edit this query in order to delete our database previously we have written update query and now we will write delete query so I will start from here write delete from your database dot your table name which is this database and this table database name and table name and then in between here delete from database dot edata and write where your employee ID is equal to this arrow pointer added text which is your this text field name and arrow pointer text so we have written delete from database dot e data where your employee ID or EID which is my column name from my database this one EID and this is this dot text field name arrow pointer text and after this all the code we don't need so we will delete which we have written in the last video so my final query is delete from database dot e data where eid is equal to single quote in between double quote in between plus and then this arrow pointer 
your text field name for employee id arrow pointer text okay and nothing much you need to change just change this message box instead of updated which we have written in the last video you can write deleted so whenever your data is deleted then you can see the message that it's really deleted now so let's try and run the program run and it's running username and password it's correct and now for example I want to delete here you can see I have 11 ent entries in my database and for example I want to delete this 11th employee ID from my database so I will write 11 here 11 and I will press delete and you can see the message it's deleted press ok and when we check in the database it's still there but when you refresh your database with this button for refresh you can see your employee ID 11 is gone once again for example I want to delete this employee ID 10 also just write it here 10 and press delete and it shows data is deleted ok and once again I will go to refresh our database from this and your data is deleted so in this way I have shown you how to delete your data with the help of a button. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.